Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you're new, welcome to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be reviewing some Fashion Nova stuff that I recently got. That's it. That's the premises of this video. So let's just get started. Here it is. I ordered this last Wednesday, November 13th. Today is Friday, November 22nd. Is it late? by like two days this was shipped with dhl but there was a delay for some reason but it wasn't canada post related but i'm still waiting on a package from canada post and they better come to an agreement soon please it's actually mainly just pants in here like jeans so we're going to see what's inside i'm going to try the pants first and then i did get like two tops which is like not really a big deal um yeah we're just gonna go through it <laughs> So the first pair of jeans I got here, the Western Star Stretch Flare Jeans. I was eyeing this for like a couple weeks, maybe a month now. Not really star pattern, but like star on the jeans kind of style. It kind of, it definitely does give like the Y2K vibe because I am trying to resonate with my Y2K era once again. And I feel like these jeans, they kind of hit the mark on that. And then also like it has, of course, like flare bottoms which is like something that i've been really really collecting recently so this is the first pair i'll try them on stop it these fit so nicely it is so comfortable stop wait i'm upset that i actually really love these i don't need a belt it's a nice high-waisted for sure the back i think is given it doesn't flatten the derriere look at that wait like the flare reaches all the way to the bottom which is like what i always always look for wow i started this video with such low expectations and now i'm just like so ecstatic wow expectations are like super high right now and they're not tight they're nice and stretchy i fit snug into these jeans like they're leggings a solid five out of five these are a solid yeah. five out of five jeans next i'm gonna be trying the mesquite y2k baggy jeans so these jeans specifically say see that yeah right there y2k they better fit like y2k jeans so they do not have the whole like fitting aspect to it but you can tell oh that pattern kind of eats but it's a lot more like in your face in person i'm a size nine in jeans and these are size nine and they did amazing these ones are also a size nine and we'll see how well it fits do i do a transition like one two three no it is not going past my hips right now i'm kind of concerned <laughs> the reason why i'm laughing right now is because this is pretty small around the waist this size 9 jeans is completely different from the other one but i also believe because the other ones were stretchy well this one is not it is though nicely at the waist like i don't need a belt but yet i feel like you can see parts of like my, my stomach kind of like peeking out from like the extreme tightness going on right now other than that i I kind of like these jeans. There's not much room for me to complain because I am actually satisfied with how these came out. I love the color of it. I feel like on camera, it's like very prominent. Like it feels like it doesn't blend nicely, but in person it blends like nicely from the light to the dark. Like it does reach the floor at a reasonable length, which is like what I really, really love. It reaches the floor. These are nice straight jeans that just reach the floor, which is what I want. And yeah, am I absolutely in love with these jeans? not at the moment i think just because like the struggle of getting it on really just set me off i was like why is this so hard to get on but other than that i do think these are a nice pair of jeans are they y2k though that's for you to decide so i will rate these jeans a solid i'll say right now they're 3.5 out of 5. of course i'm still gonna wear it are you insane we're actually at my last pair of jeans but then there are like a few tops i'm going to try i say a few it's just three don't get your hopes up this is the amber tinted 90s baggy jeans so i needed a pair of brown jeans because the ones i previously had just did not fit properly they're they're kind of baggy wow 
what was i expecting okay so it's gonna fit around my waist perfectly these are the last pair of jeans that we have here today like the waistband automatically the thing is like it's not even extremely tight but it's also not super super loose there's definitely a lot of like room to breathe the behind still looks intact which i love but it's definitely i love the bagginess because it's definitely giving like brad style vibes if i were to like wear heels with this it'd be like ah oh, chef's kiss the brown is even like a really really nice shade of brown like i'm honestly super super in love with these like i feel very nice i feel very relaxed and it's actually funny enough though these jeans are exactly pretty much the same as another pair of fashion over jeans that i got that i still wear up till this day i've had it for like three years i think now three maybe four years and counting and they're still my one number one go-to jeans there's some slight stretch to it but nothing compared to the western one and a lot more stretchier than the y2k one take with that information as you will honestly really content with it i'll give it a four out of five four out of five stars i feel like that is the right amount to give for these jeans <laughs> So, as I mentioned, I'm trying to go for a more AQB aesthetic style. And a lot of AQB things require you to layer properly. So, for example, we have this little bad boy. So, something like this can either go on top or over my clothes. In this case, I'm just going to put it over because it'll be easier. Okay. Oh, I am not doing this top justice. I know I'm supposed to put in the effort, but cut me some slack bro this is just like an example of how it looks like but imagine me wearing like a tank top maybe like a white tank top with these brown jeans it would eat i think the only thing i'm kind of upset about in regards to this top is i didn't get a size a little bit bigger i love it when my sleeves are more like oversized this is kind of like more on the kind of just but it's not a deal breaker and i actually got this also in the color black so i'm able to like mix it up change it up if i ever want to so in this case um because i'm wearing like a t-shirt i'd probably put this under the t-shirt and then if i'm wearing a tank top it would go over the tank top so it's all about how you layer and doing it right honestly and then last but not least i saw this i was like why not so this is called the love it or leave it denim 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 ultra top then yeah i was in the past we have never actually bought anything like this but now because i'm into like layering and trying new stuff i actually got this it's a denim halter top with like a nice little butterfly cuff link if you can see that it is actually really really nice imagine you don't see my t-shirt imagine it's just like the halter top and this is actually really nice now imagine wearing this with this under you can't tell me that won't that won't eat do you see do, do you see what i'm seeing this is the vision this is what i'm thinking about when i'm online shopping ways that i can use things with each other and this this eats on a real note i'm absolutely in love with the things i got i'm so excited to mix and match some more new outfits now that i have three more jeans so this is pretty much the end of my video i hope you liked it maybe this was educational for some of you maybe you learned a thing or two maybe i sparked your interest i don't know i'm just gonna go bye guys <laughs>